Introducing the all new Corolla. At yesterday's oversight hearing, GMH Administrator Joe Verga and CFO Alan Ulrich told lawmakers that the cost to implement the hay pay raises for GMH employees would be between $5.5 to $6 million, including the cost of the retirement fund, an amount they say GMH simply cannot afford. Following that hearing, however, Governor Spokesman Phil Leon Guerrero issued a statement telling us that those figures were incorrect. Today, we asked Verga to clarify those figures. The, the numbers that we gave the senators were, was, was the first iteration and the first draft uh, that, that we had, uh, our first prediction of the numbers. Our numbers have included, uh, you know, all the vacancies and, uh, you know, uh, projected uh, perhaps uh, was on the high side because it projected um, uh, some of the titles at 100% at, at, at when it should have been 50. Mm -hmm. That number could change. It could change. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, it, 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 if it changes, it, it might not change drastically. Mm -hmm. Leon Guerrero says the initial estimates GMH provided translates to about $223,000 per pay period. What it should have been, he says, is just $115,000 per pay period. The reason it was initially higher, he says it's because GMH calculated their needs for a full fiscal year as opposed to the remainder of the fiscal year. It also included 100 percent implementation for all GMH employees eligible for the hay raises. But Leon Guerrero says the governor's hay plan should only give 100 percent implementation for GMH nurses. For those under the general pay plan, they will only see 50% of their raises, hence the $115,000 for the next 17 pay periods, which comes down to about $1.9 million, a figure he says is more manageable for the hospital. Verga says GMH and the Department of Administration were working to reconcile those figures today. We're actually working with them today mm -hmm. to going, uh, you know, going through the whole um, uh, the steps and the calculations to make sure that that we both jive. So we're in the process of reconciling that today. Okay, but the bottom line is, is are there funds to implement this? Uh, in general, as I said at the hearing, I you know we we're waiting to hear from word uh, from the governor's office on funding, and I and I've been told that we will receive. Uh, some some kind of words. So we're, we're waiting on, on word of the funding. I mean, uh, as I told the senators yesterday, we hadn't received word up until that time.